Hello, that record amounts of rainfall have been recorded through parts of Texas. Where have these downpours come from? Well, actually, they've come from a pretty static weather system. It's an area of low pressure, set of weather fronts that brought heavy snowfall across Colorado through the weekend. But uh, across the deep south, the combination of warm air and moisture have provided the torrential rain. Not just across the deep south, you can see that weather front extending all the way up across the border with Canada, but it's across Texas where the angriest looking clouds have formed, fed by moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. Let's take a closer look at the radar, showing how that rain developed, particularly in the Houston area during the course of Monday. It just kept on coming. The rainfall throughout the day, topping up and topping up record breaking values. Uh, we broke the all time daily record at Houston Airport and across some parts of the city. It's thought that we recorded over 440 millimeters of rain in 24 hours. The average rainfall in Houston for April is just 85 millimeters of rain. So five times the monthly average in one day. And at Houston Airport, we pretty much had the uh, April average falling in just one hour. So that's why we've had the flooding. That weather front combining with the winds, feeding in the moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. And you can see through Tuesday and indeed throughout Wednesday, the weather patterns are pretty much the same. So we'll continue to feed in the moisture and the downpours are set to continue. More heavy rain to come, particularly across parts of Texas, but also areas through Oklahoma and Louisiana may continue to see some torrential downpours. There's a continued risk of flooding uh, for the next couple of days.